Hey you guys, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. Now in today's video, I'm looking at the products in front of me. We're gonna be covering all of the deep conditioners that I currently own. Now I originally had posted in my community tab that I will be ranking, ranking these, excuse me. I'm not gonna be doing that. That's gonna be pretty hard because I have over 10 products in front of me. I will though towards the end of this video list my or show my five favorite out of all of these. So we're gonna try to group these by regular deep conditioners, treatments, protein treatments, cholesterols, okay? So we're gonna start off with regular old deep conditioners. By the way, I have a review on nearly everything that I am showing you, so please make sure you do check out the cards, okay? First up, we have Eden Body Works Natural Deep Conditioner. It is a jojoba monoi, or monoi. Um, I got this product from Amazon.com. Now, they do have a coconut version of this. Here we go right here. I wanted to make sure that that zoomed in some. That's a little bit better. Now this is also protein free. So if you are protein sensitive, definitely check this out. I got it from amazon.com and it sells for less than 10 bucks, okay? Next up we have the Dabor Vitica. It is the deep conditioner. Um, I think this is your, their basic one. It has the, what is this nut on here? Olive almond henna. I got this one from Amazon. Now look, I used to use this stuff all the time. It is a jelly, it's almost like a jelly type consistency with oil. It's, almost, it's like if you would take jelly, a little bit of grease and olive oil and mix it up together, okay? Again, it contains olive almond. Um, I love this stuff. I, this is a large container. I got this through a site. I used to get this through Amazon. Now they have like a garlic version. They have um, one with a green top. I prefer the purple top. Again, Dabor Vatika. This is an Indian brand. Sometimes you can find them at the Indian grocery stores if you're brave enough to go outside now. <laughs> Moving on, moving along, TGIN Honey Miracle Hair Mask. Now I'm gonna be honest, this is just okay. Again, this is really why I'm not necessarily rating. Um, it's all right. I believe this is also protein free. Yeah, I find that with this particular product that I have to add certain things to it. Now, out of all of her deep conditioners, this is my favorite one I've tried. I've only tried another one. Um, that it was that CPRX one. That wasn't good at all. So yeah, it's okay. Again, TGIN Honey Miracle Hair Mask. Okay. All right, you guys. Let me see what else I have here. We have now this product I have not used on myself, but I did use it on JB. We have Sultanicos Afrotastic. Curl Elastic Deep Conditioning Treatment made with Avocado, Amla, and Xmenia. This is fairly small, eight ounces. Another reason why I used it on JB's hair, but it worked great. Um, oh, it smells so good. It smells like berries. And this was gifted to me from another subscriber. So thank you, girl. All right, you guys. So next up, I have a product that I know is ex expensive one of you let me know how expensive it was um a couple of videos ago it's the cryo low porosity all-in-one conditioner now technically this isn't a deep conditioner but you can use it as a deep conditioner um i prefer the, to use this particular product as a because I just want to, I want to be stingy and keep a lot. It's 16 ounces though. Look how, look how large this is compared to the TGIN, okay? So you can use this as a leave-in, as a pre-poo, to detangle, and of course, as a deep conditioner. Zoom in some. Again, it's the Cryo Low Porosity All-in-One Conditioner, and I am pretty sure that this is over twenty dollars okay but it's a lot of product and to be quite honest with even with all of my hair just, let's just look at the price point okay and i will be including prices below in the description box too with all of my hair 
I've been able to use this five, four or five times. An average person could use it about eight times, okay? So yeah, I absolutely love this as a deep conditioner, but again, I wanna be stingy, I wanna keep some, so I prefer it as a leave-in conditioner, okay? So um, moving right along, now we're gonna go into some products of a particular brand that I no longer support due to, um, a situation that occurred last year with someone that I um, consider a friend and she's another YouTuber. So we have the um, Miel or Myel Rosemary Mint Strengthening Hair Mask and I literally had this on my list to do a formal review on. Then when the shit hit the fan, I pulled the review. Sorry, I pulled it. But I will say, I, I will say this. I'm the type of person, I'm not gonna tell you how to use your money or how to spend your, spend your own coins. I'm not in your pocket, you're not in my pocket, okay? This is a good, this is a good deep conditioner. It does have like a tingly sensation to it. Um, yeah, so it's good, it is good. Um, also by her is the Hawaiian Ginger Moisturizing Overnight Conditioner. Now y'all were up in my comments when I reviewed this, saying that, oh, well you didn't leave it on long enough. You're supposed to leave it overnight. I would never, even though it says overnight, I don't see any, look, I really don't see any benefit in leaving a product on your hair besides having an itchy ass scalp. For me personally, I don't see a benefit of leaving a product on your hair hair for six, seven, eight hours. So I left it on maybe an hour. So it was just okay. All right, just okay. So now we're dipping into the cholesterols and hair treatments, okay? So first up we have, I love this, ORS Olive Oil Replenishing Package. I typically put two of these and one of these down below to just strengthen my deep conditioner, okay? I love this stuff. I can find it at the grocery store, Sally, whatever. It's very affordable, like a dollar and some change. It used to only be like a dollar and 20, but they're slowly adding five cents whenever I go to the store, but girl, whatever. Continuing with the ORS brand, we have the ORS. Again, ORS stands for Organic Root Stimulator. The hair made made with nettle leaf and horsetail asterisk, okay? This is a um, protein treatment, really, is what it is. Let's let that zoom in some. Okay, and this literally have flakes of, when I first reviewed this product, I was like, what the hell is this? Is it, they put parsley in my product? Girl, no, that's not parsley. I believe this is actually the nettle leaf. So it has like a mayonnaise color, but you can see bits of the nettle leaf in it. So I love this stuff, you guys. So I do have a comparison video of the Originals Best African Pride hair mayonnaise, okay? Treatment for weak, damaged hair. Now this is made with olive oil and egg protein. This particular product, again, has some flakes of something in it, oregano or something. I do have a compare, this is a little, the fragrance is a little out there. I do have a comparison video comparing both of these products, okay? So definitely check that out. Um, now we're gonna move into the cholesterols. Now. Just to let you guys know, I do have a affiliated with Hollywood Beauty, but I am very honest with my reviews, um, okay, just to let you know. So Hollywood Beauty sent me tons of cholesterols um, a couple of years ago, and so I have a couple of still. So we have their Olive Cholesterol Super Shine and Moisture. This is the green container. The reason why I definitely love their products, um, their line of cholesterols, excuse me, is so thick. Look at that, it's very, very thick. Along with Hollywood Beauty, we have their Carrot Cholesterol Deep Conditioning Cream. There's nothing left in this. Um, now I will say, and I, I'm gonna, I have one more cholesterol to so, show y'all. When you're talking about these products, these don't have, let me tell you something. They're very, very cheap, very affordable. There are not great, um, there's not great 
ingredients in these products. So a lot of them may have sulfates, a lot of them may have mineral oil. It is what it is. They work for me, but I can understand if these same products will not work for you. The last cholesterol I have, which I absolutely love, Queen Helen Cholesterol hair conditioning cream. Now, I typically get this online on, on um, Amazon, a big jar of it for like six, seven bucks. Again, very thick. Now, girl, this looks like perm. Yeah, it, it, it's so thick, it looks like perm. So I typically, again, with my cholesterols, I typically mix with other products. Now, I do have two deep conditioners here that I have not used yet, and I'm excited to use it. I won't be officially reviewing them, but I will be mentioning them in additional um, videos, com or videos coming up. We have the Adawa, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. I do apologize. The Adawa Deep Conditioning Treatment, which was gifted to me, and this got great reviews. It smells really good. And then I purchased this product a long time ago through Sally's. It's their generic deep conditioning hair mask. It's a 10. It's basically the generic for it's a 10. It's a 10. Um, let's let that zoom in some. This is basically a light protein treatment. So y'all looking at what I have here, I'm gonna show you my, and it varies. My top deep conditioners vary by what's going on with my hair, you know, like the current condition my condition of my hair. But I'm gonna try to pull up my top five here. Three, four, all right. Oh, it is what it is. All right, top five. Top five for me here. We have the Davor Vatica Purple Top. We have the Cryo all in one now if you like vivian i'm on a budget i'm not gonna be able to do that i would recommend the eden body works natural deep conditioner okay ors olive oil replenishing pack i all you can also get this in a jar in a bottle okay if you don't want to be spending one or two dollars every time you go to the store like me we have the ors hair mayonnaise okay and last but not least, oldie but goodie, Queen Helen Cholesterol, okay? So that is it, you guys. Now, there have been other masks and treatments that have been fabulous. Let me say, that Aphrogy, it was like a textured treatment that I used last year. That deep conditioner was the bomb.com. So let me know, you guys, drop in the comments below what are your favorite deep conditioners, your hair mask, hair treatments. So that is it, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.